what's the move? Can I tell the truth? If I was doing this for you, then I have nothing left to prove. Nah, this for me though. I'm just trying to stay alive. Hey guys, it's Drummer. So I haven't posted a video in a while. I've been just doing school and stuff, but now that I'm on Christmas break, I'm gonna try and post a few more videos. But uh, I've, my account's changed a lot since last time I recorded a video. So I got to evolve uh, Pumpkin Duke and Santa Boom. But I haven't changed too many talents. Yeah, I think I'll about all the talents the same, except I got Skull Knight too. And he's the only heroes I've really wanted. I still haven't gotten a Vlad though, and that sucks. But the next hero I'm planning to evolve is Minnow. And um, I'm saving up shards right now. I'm getting pretty close, just 4,000 away. And I'm going to try and evolve him. And I used to think that uh, you couldn't evolve heroes if you didn't have enough gold storage. But actually you can, and it only costs like 800 gems if you have like about three, about what I have right now. It costs really 800 gems. So that's good. I was gonna get this quick, but yeah. So I'll just go through my heroes real quick, and uh, yeah. So I got Pumpkin Duke eight or ten, love it, Berserk. Uh, re revive two on him, and then I finally got Santa Boom to level one hundred inscribed, which is good. And he's a two life drain, six of eight War God, and I'm getting close. I have um, what's this? I have let me see. I I have five. Level 7 talent runes, so I'm getting, uh, right now I've been using all my fame just to get uh, evolution stones, but yeah. So I need to buy one of those for him. I'm just going to try and ha always have two in case I get a new hero or something. Like, I just want to keep 2,000 so I'm able to buy some. And then my Minotaur has a 7 of 10, 2 of 5 revite, level 90 inscribed, and a 5 of 8 stone skin. I think my Cupid's about the same. Um... Skull Knight, I got him to 7 of 10. Uh, Scribe 90, Bulwark 2. I'm still working on a talent for him. I just haven't been rolling talents recently because I'm planning on getting a Vlad, or I'm hoping to get a Vlad. And then uh, I've got Orc Spain. I'm close to a 3 day Berserk set. I have enough to make a Berserk 3 of everything, except the one I don't have is 2. I, don't, I need a few more of a Berserk 2, and then I can make a full Berserk 3 set. And then I've got uh, Immortal Peas, about the same. Uh, Spirit Mage. Ares. Two of I Revite. I think he's the same. Druid, same. Just described 80. And then I've got Warlock, level 3. Uh, Sprint, level 2 of I Revite. Triantar, 6 of 10. I got a few talents up too on my second day heroes. And I just Pixie Thunder God, all my second days. And then. Yeah, and then him. And also, I have a 4 of 8 revive. I couldn't really decide what to do with it yet, so I think I'm just going to wait and, and see if I can get another hero or something. But if not, I'll probably just put it on Atlanta for But I like the talent he has now, so I'm not really sure. Yeah, and then Dove And then these are all just my secondary heroes. They're all inscribed uh, 60 or 80, depending on what their max is for their level. And then, yeah. So... I hit 80,000 might too, I'm at 83,000 right now. Uh, my artifacts, I got these at level 2 and then these at level 3. I only have two heroes I can put in them right now though, so yeah, so I can't really use, I can only use two at a time, so that kind of blows. And then I really want to unlock these, which are the two best, but for insane dungeons, I'm still, I'm still an expert. I'm still on this one right here. I really can't beat it. That's why I'm mainly evolving my minnow so that I can uh, unlock these two artifacts and use them to beat the expert and then insane dungeons. I think it'll be a huge help there. And then for here be monsters, I don't know if I'd beaten Q in my last video, but yeah, I beat Q and R. I just beat R yesterday actually, so I was really excited to do that, and now I can sweep it, which is great. So yeah, I've been doing that. And the heroes I use for uh, heavy monsters are these right here. So, yeah, these are my mains I use. I would love to switch him for Vlad and him for Duelum, but just haven't been able to yet. So I use Skull Knight, Immortep, Oryx Spain, uh, Pumpkin Duke, Cupid, and Sandaboom. And especially because 
Dana Boom's evolved, he basically just wipes out all waves. And I put the crit one on him, so he has a 13% chance to do crits and a 30% chance to increase his attack, and that's huge. It makes a huge difference, I think. And yeah, so I just used all my Eerie Monster strats this week. Uh, I'll, I guess I'll just try and do an insane dun uh, the expert dungeon right now. For expert dungeons, I use uh, Triantar and then Minotaur. That's really the only change I make between that and my Hairdo Monsters team, so yeah. We'll go ahead and give it a try. This one's really hard because of all the stun towers, but. Oh, wait, one of my hands is I just might as well go that way. So, yeah, let's try it. Um, I've tried almost every drop, but I'll just go from over here, I guess. So, yeah. And then I usually tank what's coming. If I could get a Sight Heal Crest, that would also be very nice, but, yeah. So, yeah, the, basically just get destroyed by all the arrow towers and everything, I can never really beat it. And that's kind of disappointing, but yeah. Um, in Lost Realm, I'm level 18, yeah. Level 18, this is the team I use. It's, as it beats teams pretty fast. If I could have a Vlad instead of Ares, that'd be great. But Ares is best for the player versus player. I like the battle altar, so yeah. Uh, also, I guess I'm I'm on L16 here, so yeah. And then arena, I don't do arena much, but I'll just might as well just run the ridge real quick. I don't have that many high revites except my keep it as four or five, but I do all right for arena, I think. My sand boom is definitely a huge help. He destroys everything. Yeah, see, if he lets two missiles loose on the on the other team, then they almost always die, even if they're wrong. This one looks pretty easy. Having the king rank king rank also is a huge help in arena. So. I can usually get up to around 800 in Arena before they start being like all Harpy Queen, Dread Drake, Clap of Revite, Warlock, Ares, and all them. So yeah, that's usually where I get to before I do that. If I get some more Revites, I could probably get a lot higher. Yeah, see those two missiles every time, they just take a minute. Last one. Yeah, this is one of those teams called the 5 5 Revites. Yeah. Usually I can just challenge the second guy though and find someone I can beat, but those teams are almost impossible to beat with, with unless you have 5 5 Revites of your own. So, yeah. Uh, but these, my main heroes are basically these right here. These are the heroes I use the most. I use this base to beat R. It, it doesn't look that great, but it actually worked really well. Uh, yeah, so. Especially if you don't have Vlad, this is a good base. If, I have Vlad, if you have Vlad, you can probably beat it, beat it no problem, but. So I'll go ahead and run some L12 trials and then I'll just end the video. Minotaur is actually really good for L12, I think. Mortap's fine too, but I just put Minnow in there because he stuns everyone. Plus, he reduces all their images. If I could get a Vlad, it would make almost everything easier. I'm still hoping to get one, but I don't know. It's been like a year. I've wanted one for a year and I still haven't gotten one, so. Can't say.
the main focus right now is just getting Minotaur up, because if I can get him up as high as possible, it'll make all the dungeons easier. And then when I beat the dungeons, I can get these, and these are the two most overpowered uh, artifacts by like, a lot. So yeah. And uh, I've been upgrading all my swords still. I have them all at 18, and these are all upgrading to 19. Yeah, and then this is just the base I, I use to beat R. I'll run one more outsource, I guess, and then I'll end it. Oh, that's stupid. My hair's always hacking that out when I'm trying. That snow girl is a pretty easy one. I hope I can get one of the new heroes here, because the update recently came out last week, so, or this week, but I'm really hoping to get, like, Candy King or Ghoulin. I want Ghoulin and Vlad definitely the most, so they seem like the two newest overpowered heroes. Ghoulin seems, I've gone up against Ghoulin, and Ghoulin's crazy. He's almost a Vlad without a stun, but he does so much damage, it doesn't even matter. Plus, he can't be stunned, and he, uh, heals so much that he's, like, Invincible. He's one. Of the, I think he's one of the best heroes now. But yeah. Anyway, uh, thanks for watching. Uh, I'm gonna end this video. I'll probably make a few more videos by the end of break. So I have two weeks off. So I'll try to get as many videos as I can. Hopefully, I'll get one or two more before Christmas. And yeah. Thanks for watching. See you.